All right, everybody, this is Bear from bearindependent.com, and now we are talking about the Bear Minimum individual first aid kit. Pouch by Sojourn Gear, contents by adventurefrontier.com, Molly compatible outer pouch, hand sewn in the United States, specified by Bear. Would I bet my life on it? It has my name on it. The answer is yes. So this is a super cool little pouch. This is like uh, just about the right size for Leo's. It's almost the exact same size. Here is your standard US mill IFAC pouch. Here's the bear fac right next to each other. So you all see that? Okay. Mill serp pouch, bear fac pouch. Comparable, right? Interesting. Cool. All right. So here's the bear fac pouch. Law, enforce and law enforcement? That's not even a word. Law enforcement officers. Uh, all the tactical stuff that you're doing out there, your line one, your line two, your war belt, or your plate carrier. I mean, look, Shazam, right? Shazam, Shazam. Okay, and this is the Coyote Brown, by the way. So your line one, your line two on your range, range bag for any agencies, for, uh, like I said, Leos, for my sheriffs out there, paramedics, man, um, anybody who's carrying a weapon, firefighters even, chainsaws something you don't hear a lot about but this would be great to have on your chaps if you're operating a chainsaw because man i've been cut with a chainsaw a couple of times and it's definitely a situation where you want to stop some blood and uh in the game of making holes stopping holes and plugging holes this is for plugging holes so i'm going to show you what we're dealing with here stand by all right so this is the outer pouch it's made of 500 denier nylon i believe it's 500 it's, it's a good, super high quality pouch. It ties in the back. So rather than those obnoxious buckles like these, or the snaps rather, when you're rolling around and you're doing the operational things, these get popped and now your pouch is flopping around all over the place. This ties on, okay? So you tie this on, it is Molly capable. You can also run it on a belt. Um, outer pouch, clamshell design, hand sewn by brother Cody at sojourngear.com. Pop this open. Grab this tab, pull. Okay, and so this stays on your belt, your plate carrier, your rucksack, your chainsaw chaps, your whatever, okay? And then this gets it out where you need it. This gets your product out where you can use it. And so we have a drawstring here, grommet, and this is like a 70 denier, almost like a parachute silk, but it's nylon. And so this is not waterproof, but it is very water resistant, okay? Very water resistant. And that'll help when you're out operating operationally like an operator out there in the great wild blue yonder. If you get rained on, you're good to go. So in this kit, we have shears, high fin chest seal, decompression needle, a generation seven cat tourniquet, five by nine combine pads, trauma dressing. Wait a minute. No, that's the right one. Trauma dressing, I'm like, this is too much stuff. I'm reading the wrong kit. No, but it's the right kit. Uh, trauma dressing, tape, gloves, NPA and lube, Mylar blanket, and the Sojourn Gear custom pouch. Okay, and just for size comparison, here's the Condor EMT light pouch, and here's the Sojourn pouch. They're almost identical in size, okay? And here's the standard... Uh, military surplus pouch. I mean, they're all right about the same size. So we'll remove this over here. We'll remove this over here. We'll get into the contents of this. So you got a set of nitro gloves, paper tape, legit 14 gauge by three and a quarter inch long uh, decompression needle, Gen 7 cat tourniquet, ready to go, brand new in the package. North American Rescue trauma dressing. This is a pressure dressing. And, and see, the idea behind this too is like, you need this, you need it now, bam, rapid deploy, okay? So we've got nasal pharyngeal airway. Actually got two stuffed in that kit. That would have been a lucky day for somebody. Two combine pads and full-size high fin chest seals. Not the compact, these are the full size. So you've got chest seals. Here's your airway right here, you got this blood stoppage, set of shears, emergency blanket for treating um, 
you know, hypothermia or shock or whatever. You got your pressure dressing here. We've got tape, we've got gloves, and we've got shears, and we've got gauze. Now, some would say, well, that needs quick clot in it. Listen, this is the bare minimum kit. We could put quick clot in here. It would take up space. It would cost more money. And here's the deal. You can stuff a wound. Battlefield medicine is finding now that the effectiveness of quick clot versus packing a wound and applying pressure is basically nil. It's basically nil. So for those that want the quick clot, check out the bare fac. If you're okay without quick clot, check out the bare minimum. And would I bet my life on this kit? Oh, hell yeah, absolutely I would. So this is the bare minimum kit. Let's spin this camera around. Okay, so the MSRP on this kit is $135 US. Now, and I get all the comments. Check this out. You can compare this kit to the Dark Angel Medical Slim Trauma Kit, which is $205, or the My Medic The Shield Kit, which is $150. So this is anywhere between $15 and $70 less than a comparable kit. This is made in the United States of America by hand. With the rapid deploy system, my specification, pouch made by Sojourn Gear, guts made, uh, provided by adventurefrontier.com, legitimate top end contents. It's not some questionable Chinese manufacturer stuff. This is North American Rescue, brand new in package, trauma dressing, brand new cat tourniquet, full size high fin chest seals full-size decompression needle, nasal pharyngeal airway, even a North American Rescue survival blanket, and a NAR shears. Um, there, there's nothing cheap about this kit. It's top of the line contents and it's the bare minimum. It's what you need that if you are hit by a round, what do I need to stop it, right? To sustain life until somebody more qualified comes along or I get you to somebody more qualified so that we can affect positive change on the situation. It's the bare minimum. And it's, it's exactly what I want it to be. It's a perfect belt kit for a Leo. It's a perfect EDC pouch. It's great to throw in a backpack. Anywhere you're making holes, anywhere you're carrying one of these, having a way to having one of these on you, if you think you might have to put rounds on target, whatever that target looks like, whether it's a silhouette target, a steel target, or, or a ne'er-do-well on two legs, um, if you have the ability to make holes, you should have the ability to plug holes, and that's exactly what this kit does. So this kit comes in coyote, which you got right here. Comes in OD green. It comes in gray. The gray is sexy. It's beautiful. It is tremendous. Uh, and it comes in black. It weighs about two pounds, I'm guessing. I haven't put it on a scale. You can get it at bearindependent.com slash shop. You can check out Sojourn Gear, S-E-W-J-O-U-R-N, G E A A E E A O U Sojourn Gear S E W J O U R N G E A R SojournGear.com or AdventureFrontier.com and uh, yeah you know go check out some other comparable kits come back to this one 135 bucks made in America supports real Americans with real families doing real things making real products by hand I couldn't be more proud of this product. Tell everybody, let your friends know, man, it, this, this kit's awesome. You know, people say, would you bet your life to it? It's got my name on it. Yes, I would bet my life on it. That's exactly what I would do with it. That's why it exists. And the reason we are doing these kits is because so many people have asked me, what should I buy? And there's lots of great kits out there. You can get, you can buy other kits. You can make a kit yourself and that's fine. I'm not saying we're any better than anybody else, but I am saying we don't suck. And it's a good quality product at an equitable price that feeds real people's families. So uh, respectfully consider our options, please. Don't forget about us. The bare fact and the bare minimum, they're tremendous. They are, believe me, believe me, Melania is beautiful and Mexico is going to pay for it.